Hi everyone. Today we're going to learn how to make this new stitch. Um, I was playing around with stitches a few months ago and came up with this and I have searched far and wide and I can't find anybody that's done it. And it's a combination of the paired single crochet and the extended single crochet. So I've just called it the paired extended single crochet. If you know what it's called, if you've seen somebody that's done it before, let me know because I have not been able to find it. And I would love to know if it has a different name. So it does create a very stiff fabric and it has the same appearance on both sides. And this will be a really quick tutorial. And we'll go ahead and get started. So when you have a new row that you're starting on, you'll chain one at the beginning of that. And then in its first stitch, you'll do a half double crochet. Now to do this paired extended single crochet, you'll start in the previous stitch you just worked by inserting your hook. You'll yarn over and bring up a loop and that'll give you two loops on your hook. Then you're going to insert your hook into the next stitch, yarn over and pull up a loop. And then you're just going to continue to pull that through the first loop on your hook. So then you'll have two loops on your hook again. Go ahead and yarn over and pull through those remaining two. And that's all this stitch is, is you just go into the previous stitch you just worked and pull up a loop and then go into the next stitch, bring up a loop and pull that through one of the loops and then yarn over and pull through both loops. You'll just do this all the way across your row. And once you're at the end, you just chain one, turn your work and start over again with a half double crochet in the first stitch. So it's super easy, be good to use with a hot plate or even a dishcloth. I don't know if it would be as good for a dish towel since it is so stiff.